This person made ninja. <laughs> How's it going, gamers? I recently decided I was gonna rate people's dwarf fits. I feel like I have the ability to really spot something fashionable, you know? If you don't see yours, I'm very sorry, but I got like way more submissions than I thought I would. Let's begin. The first thing I got was this. That's not a dwarf. Um, terrible. Next we have Musical Hex. They sent in this guy. He's, he's all right, he's pretty good. I like the beard mustache combo, but I don't know about the color combos. I think yellow and purple works kind of well, but it's all right, it's all right. I'd say this is like a, like a B. Wimmy over here, we got this little guy. I like the combo of the armor color and that bandana. That's really well done. That's actually very good stuff. I think you really nailed it. This is definitely, I'm feeling an A on this one. That's good. Oh God. I don't like this guy. This guy sucks. Why would you make this guy? This one's a D. I have no, I don't even have to explain myself. That's just a D. Ooh, this one's good. See, there's a lot to this. Like when you show the weapon included, that's when you're really going all out. Then you get like bonus points. Cause it's like, not only did you match the helmet and the armor and stuff really well, like you got the blue tats, got the same color blue pants. The lights on the hat match the lights on the gun skin and the gun skin generally matches the greenish gray on the armor. Ooh, I, this is an S. This is the first S uh, rank. Congratulations to Hobbs, masterfully done. This guy kind of looks like if you took Speed Racer and like threw him in a puddle of mud. I think this one's like a C for me. I don't love it, but I think you had some cool ideas going on there. And you know, that's what matters in the end. Ooh, using that new beard color, Robot Rebellion NG armor, one of the best NG armors. This is an A. This is an A for sure, no doubt. Great stuff. Next we have Green Man. I hate this guy. Um, the amount of effort that went into putting the most green physically possible on a single dwarf is, is impressive, I will say. Oh my god, is he ugly. I mean, it's just a, it's just a nightmare creation. The beard is a little bit of a flex. That's one of the more expensive beards in the game, which is kind of sick. I, I do respect that. But I don't like the green and purple. Not, not messing with it. And the white hat. It just looks weird, man. That's a D. Sorry. See, this armor I don't think is going to show up often. It's kind of weird. Uh, this guy kind of looks like a walking Cheeto. You know, that's a, that's a D. Ooh, I like this one, though. This is from the same person. This Cyclops light eye thing is showing up a lot. But I love that beard. That's one of my favorites. This is good. I'd say it's like a A. I love the colors. Andrew, I guess, sent in this. I don't know where, what you think you're doing. You can't be doing this. This is an F. I love the colors. Really well done there. I like it. It suits him well. He's, he looks like a very worn individual. I think a different beard color would work a little bit better here, but the hat combo with the armor is very good. I'd give that like a, an, um, an A. It's good. Listen, I... I got, I'm trying to hold myself back, but listen, this looks really bad. This guy looks nasty. His beard is just wicked gross, and his armor is kind of the color of, like, mustard that has gone bad. This one's definitely an F for me. Not feeling that one. Ooh, I like this guy. This is, like, the kind of guy I want to hang out with, you know? I want to sit down and have, like, a drink with this guy. Got the caterpillar stash. Very well-trimmed beard. And that hat is just, like, the cherry on top. Literally. Good job on that one. I give that one an S. There he is. First crown spotting of the day, and I have to give it an A. All right, listen, I could just sit here and give every crown an S, but you know, that's not what I'm here for. I'm here to rate things in a good way. All right, I was expecting at least one Donald Trump. I This is the first one so far. I give it an F. So I don't want to see Donald Trump. Another Donald Trump. There he is. I uh, hate it. F again. But this guy, same same person that submitted Donald Trump, this is beautiful. Like, the management you have to do to hold that hair how it is, is impressive. Like, the amount of product. This is an S tier. This really shows the potential of Deep Rock and its cosmetics. I mean, it's just come so far. Ooh, this is one of my favorite hats in the game. This little, like, stupid orb head. And for one of my least favorite armor colors for NG. I think you, you pulled it off for sure. It, it's good. I think it's a B. Ooh, nice. I don't even have to say anything. That's an S. Damn, I love that. This guy's like a devilish little fellow. Like this guy would steal your brown sugar cinnamon pop tarts and not say anything about it. Uh, I'm going to give him like a B. All right, another one we're going to see a lot, Eggman. 
Uh, Eggman is a classic in the deep rock sphere. Everyone makes Eggman at some point. I'm gonna give it a C. This is one of my least favorite gunner armors. I don't like that thing in the front. I know if you have a beard, it goes away, but I don't like how it looks. Uh, I'm just not a fan of like the super boxy big helmets. I, I, I get the vibe and I get why people would like them, but for me personally, just not into it. I'm gonna give this one a D. Oh my, how did you make him look like this? What the hell? I mean, this is impressive, definitely. There's a lot going on here, but I think the colors, especially the paint being the robot one, I don't know. I don't think it's the right choice paint-wise. I think I'm gonna give it like a C, it's all right. Oh, this person made Yondu. That's actually really well done. Philip L over here dropping bangers. I love the color choices. Love that you included the gun to really show off the full fit. I don't know what you did to make this image look so concerning. Um, it looks like an Oompa Loompa. And also, now that, that I look at it, the fingers on the dwarves are really uncomfortably long looking. Uh, that's kind of freaking me out. I don't even want to rate it. I like this guy. Uh, that's one of my favorite mustaches in the game. It just looks so funny. Uh, it kind of makes you look like the Lorax. And that is just something really important to, to the whole experience. Overall, I think it's pretty good. That's a good use of the rival paint too. Uh, it's hard to use for armor. Uh, I'm gonna give that a B. Yo, I love this guy. Oh my God, this is so good. This guy looks awesome. Uh, S tier, no doubt. <gasps> this guy's golfing. This guy has to golf or play the bagpipes or some shit. Wow, there's so much, there's so much potential. I'm learning. This is unlocking so many new realms for me. I didn't even know you could make a dwarf look like this. I love this guy. This is horrible. This guy looks greasy and soppy. He looks like he smells really bad. Uh, F tier. This person made ninja. <laughs> no, no, don't make ninja. You, you did actually nail it. Now this dwarf would definitely tweet about his braless wife. This is an A tier, that's pretty good. It's almost like a spider of facial hair. How did you, that's insane. I don't really, I can't even judge that one. I just don't feel like I have the credentials for that. Snake with a hat sent in this one. I like this. This is actually a really good use of this goofy hat. You actually match the colors really well, which I, I didn't know you could do with that hat. That's, I think that one's an A tier. That's really good. I like what's going on. I think there's definitely a lot of potential here, but I think the mustache is a little weak for this guy. I don't know. I think he deserves a little more in the stash department. Uh, I think it's like a B. Oh, it's Yosemite Sam. I love that. This is the Pope. Apparently, this is the name of this one is the Pope. I like that it's the Pope and it also has a golden skin. The armor, kind of mid though. I think the armor choice definitely needs some fine tuning. You're pretty low level. You probably don't have many cosmetics, but hey, I believe in you. This is a C tier for now, but listen, the Pope can go much further. Ew, what? Oh, I don't like him. Is this Bart Simpson? Oh my God, this is totally supposed to be Bart. That's like really funny. I never thought about making it like Bart. I don't like the Bart one. Uh, that's an F. I hate it. There's another Donald Trump. Third Donald Trump. Ooh, we got DRG Historian. So we're gonna dig deep. We're gonna do a whole review of, of the DRG Historian discography of dwarves. First up, these two scouts. The uh, one on the left, the green guy, pretty good. I like that hat combo with that facial hair. Very good. He kind of looks like an orc. And I like that the weapon kind of fits that vibe too. He's got that Wastelander skin. Very well done. Colors are good vibe is on definitely an a tier no doubt the one on the right mm, is pretty good too i think i just like it a little less than the other one it's a it's an okay one i give it like a c we move on to the engineer options from drg historian they're they all got some similarities especially in that uh in the facial hair being the yosemite sam mustache and then like a little braided thing i think my favorite of these the second one Third one with the streamer hat, kind of flexing a little bit, do appreciate that. I think overall your NG is definitely like an A. Um, the description of this guy is that he's full of piss. So that's great. I don't like him. Uh, it might be the description that, that makes it worse for me, but not a fan of this one. Uh, I'm gonna give it an F. I like that, that's a good use of the of the armor color there. I think you nailed this. He's kind of like a high tech pirate kind of guy. I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give that a B. That's pretty good. Holy crap. What did you do to this guy? You did this guy dirty. I don't like that. I'm sorry, I'm gonna give that one a D. I love you, Grump, but that guy's weird. Let's look at another one of yours. Ooh, this one's pretty good. Definitely really unique looking for uh, 
a scout. I wouldn't even be able to tell this is scout. That's impressive. Uh, I like that one. I'm gonna give it a B. Another Eggman. You know, it's inevitable. Uh, I do like this stance with the <laughs> with the sentry though. It's kind of ominous. I feel like I'm being threatened right now a little bit. I'm like happy for him. Like I don't know why, but I'm just like, I I just look at this guy and I'm happy for him. I feel like I could learn so much from him. Like he could tell me very wise stories. This guy, he holds some forbidden knowledge. Like this guy would be on top of a mountain, right? And you go up there and he's just like, Hello, come solve my puzzle. Would you like to solve my puzzle? And you're like, yeah, sure, I'll solve your puzzle. And he just gives you like Sudoku. This guy's good, but I do think he looks like he'd listen to Freebird. I'm just gonna leave it that way. Really. Ooh, I like that you put the crossbow in this guy's hands. That feels right. You know your stuff. You look at some people and you're like, ooh, that's a great NG. I love that armor color. That's one of my favorites. Hell yeah. Detective Evolve is an honorable mention for one of the best. This, even this gunner, dang, nice. That guy looks like Jack Black or some shit. Ooh, Midnight Sun Madness with the wise kind of Hagrid-like dwarf. Oh my God, the contrast between these two, like this very nice looking guy and then this twisted psychopath. Oh, how did, what did you do to him? I, I don't know what you did to this guy. He's like trapped in there. He's like a little bug. I kind of feel threatened in a way. He's kind of staring into my soul and holding a grenade launcher. You got the right colors going on other than the gun. The gun doesn't really fit, but I'm scared of that man. Donald Trump again. Dorf Furious, what do you think you're doing right now? You can't be posting this. You can't be posting this. No, no, you. this isn't your dwarf though. You, you can't be doing this. This is illegal. You're breaking the law right now. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to call the barrel armor police on you. This is not okay. Ooh, I like this guy. He's like a little outlaw. He looks like he's got a big iron on his hip. <laughs> what the heck? I like that he's holding the IFG. It feels like perfect. Like that's what he should be holding. I, I wouldn't say I like love it, but it it's really funny. Ooh, this driller is perfect. This is another S here. Who is this? Chazzy? Good job. Love the colors. That's perfect. Oh my gosh. This is the most yellow guy ever. This is that Coldplay song, Yellow. When they said it was all yellow, they were thinking of this guy. That's all of them. That's all the dwarfs for now, all right? I've been recording for 50 minutes. <laughs> But thank you for sending your dwarves in. I really appreciate it. This was more fun than I thought. I hope my commentary is okay. I feel like I just kind of said basic things, but like there's only so much you can say about the dwarves, right? I might do one in the future, but maybe more of like a themed one where I ask you to make like a specific theme and then I review your stuff, you know? Throw your ideas for themes in the comments and I'll, I'll look through those actually. I, I definitely would consider doing that in the future. So that was fun. Y'all did a pretty decent job overall. I'm pretty impressed with your, your dwarf skills. Go check out my other videos where I put way more effort in. Um, and, you know, subscribe to my channel if you like it. Hope you enjoyed this, I guess. Have a good rest of your day. Rock and stone. Oh, God. I didn't see this one. This one's terrible.